Erin Gray, a well-known actress with a long career, has made a significant impact in the entertainment industry. Whether her work brings back fond memories or makes you think about the highlights of her career, it's clear she's made a big contribution. Among her many roles, which one do you think was the most important in her career? We'd love to hear your stories or personal experiences related to this famous actress. Share your favorite memories or moments in the comments below. Keep watching as we share amusing, surprising, and even touching stories about Erin Gray in our next videos. Your stories are important to us, and we're excited to read them. Erin Gray, known for her work in television and film, has been in various notable projects. Among them are Buck Rogers in the 25th Century and Silver Spoons. Fans of hers should definitely watch Buck Rogers in the 25th Century, where she played Colonel Wilma Deering, a strong character. Another great show to see her in is Silver Spoons, where she portrayed Kate Summers Stratton, showcasing her versatility. For those new to her work, Buck Rogers and the 25th Century is a good place to start. It's a classic sci-fi series with action and memorable characters. Silver Spoons is also worth watching, offering comedy and heartwarming moments. Aside from these projects, fans may enjoy exploring more of her filmography to see the range of her talent and the depth of her performances. From TV series to films, Erin Gray has left her impression on the entertainment industry with her memorable roles and contributions. Born in Honolulu, Hawaii, Erin Gray shares her birthplace with fellow actor Nicholas Horman, who starred alongside her in Space Vampire. Their journey into science fiction began with a role in Logan's Run, although her scenes were cut from the final movie. Despite this setback, she modeled a costume for the film in a 1975 promotional video by MGM. In 1969, she faced a big decision when offered the lead role in Goodbye, Columbus. Her hesitation came from not wanting to do intimate scenes, influenced by her husband's role in the Vietnam War. This shows her commitment to her values and personal boundaries in the film industry. Her connection with Logan's run and the decision regarding Goodbye, Columbus show the choices that shape an actor's career. Her resilience and principled decisions have contributed to her career in entertainment. In summary, Erin Gray's journey, marked by both triumphs and challenges, showcases her resilience and integrity in the world of science fiction and beyond embodying a compelling narrative. Known for her role as Colonel Wilma Deering and Buck Rogers in the 25th century, Erin Gray skillfully balanced her professional and personal life. Her daughter, Samantha Gray Hissong, born from her marriage to Richard Hissong, brought her immense joy. Alongside Samantha, she cherished the bond with her son, Kevin Gray Schwartz, from her previous marriage to Ken Schwartz. When she took on the role of Colonel Wilma Deering, the producers asked her to change her hair color to blonde. Initially agreeing, she later went back to her natural brunette color during the first season. By the start of the second season, her hair was fully brunette, showing her commitment to being true to herself. These details in her portrayal not only added depth to the character of Wilma Deering, but also showcased Erin Gray's versatility as an actress. Her ability to bring authenticity to her roles earned admiration from audiences worldwide. The impact she made through her performances continues to inspire aspiring actors and fans representing timeless talent. Renowned for portraying Colonel Wilma Deering and Buck Rogers in the 25th century, Erin Gray displayed her versatility when auditioning for Captain Catherine Janeway on Star Trek Voyager in 1995. Although the role went to Kate Mulgrew, her audition made a lasting impression. Besides acting, she blends her passion for the arts with a focus on well-being. She advocates for ancient practices like Tai Chi and Kai Gong, sharing her knowledge with enthusiasts and teaching at UCLA. In entertainment, her journey is marked not only by on-screen success, but also by her efforts to promote balance and tranquility. Her commitment to sharing the benefits of Tai Chi and Kai Gong reflects her dedication to a harmonious life. In Hollywood, her story is one of resilience and adaptability. Her auditions, whether successful or not, show her enduring spirit and pursuit of growth. Erin Gray's impact extends beyond her roles, encompassing her contributions to entertainment and holistic health, a narrative beautifully. Erin Gray, famous for her role as Colonel Wilma Deering in Buck Rogers in the 25th century, made her debut appearance in this cinematic series. Interestingly, she was considered for the role of Captain Catherine Janeway on Star Trek Voyager in 1995. 
During the casting process for Buck Rogers, Gil Gerard, who was a bit older than what the producer originally wanted, impressed the director, Daniel Haller, with his screen test. Despite being 35 at the time, Gerard's chemistry with Gray during auditions and his natural charisma convinced Haller to overlook the character's age specifications as outlined in the original comic strip. This decision led to Gerard landing the lead role alongside Gray. Gray's involvement in Buck Rogers in the 25th century not only showcased her acting abilities, but also contributed to the success of the series. Her portrayal of Colonel Wilma Deering remains a memorable aspect of the show's legacy. The collaboration between Gerard and Gray during auditions played a crucial role in Gerard securing the lead role despite age considerations. Gray's performance as Colonel Wilma Deering added significant value to the show's overall success. Aaron Gray, recognized for portraying Colonel Wilma Deering in Buck Rogers in the 25th century, initially hesitated before returning to the iconic role. Originally, Juan and Clay was considered for the part, but Aaron Gray eventually reprised the character. In a memorable episode titled Buck Rogers in the 25th century Vegas in Space, she made a guest appearance as Major Marla Landers, a character reminiscent of Deering. During her high school years at Redwood High School in Larkspur, California, Erin Gray later delivered the commencement address to the graduating class of 1992. The series Buck Rogers in the 25th century quickly gained a dedicated fan base, especially among teenagers. Some enthusiasts attempted to enter the studio grounds to meet the actors. Teenage girls, captivated by Gil Gerard, made various attempts to sneak onto the premises. One fan even offered money to a studio employee to smuggle her inside in a car trunk, though the offer was declined. Erin Gray herself encountered an ardent admirer who arrived at the studio entrance bearing gifts of roses and chocolates. Despite the gesture, he was not permitted to enter, and there's no record of Gray meeting him at the entrance. Even Felix Silla, another actor from the show, had a few fervent female admirers trying to sneak into the building during filming. Aaron Gray's portrayal of Colonel Wilma Deering left a lasting impression on Buck Rogers in the 25th century fans, attracting a dedicated following eager to engage with the show's world and characters. Erin Gray, known for her role in the popular TV series Buck Rogers in the 25th century, faced a tough time when she got seriously ill during her peak career. This unexpected health issue paused her acting for a while, leaving fans surprised and saddened by her absence from the screen. Despite this challenge, Gray didn't give up. She fought hard against the illness and eventually beat it. When she returned to acting, it wasn't just a comeback, it was a victory that inspired her fans and showed her strength in tough times. Throughout her career, Gray showed not only her acting talent, but also her ability to overcome obstacles. Her story reminds us that life can be tough, but with determination, we can achieve our dreams. Despite the difficulties she faced, Erin Gray's story of strength and resilience continues to inspire fans. It's a reminder of the human spirit's power to overcome challenges. Did you know that despite her successful acting career, Erin Gray faced a personal tragedy? Her first husband, with whom she shared a life before her rise to fame, tragically passed away in a car accident. This heartbreaking event cast a shadow over her early years in the entertainment industry. Despite the sorrow she experienced, she continued to pursue her passion for acting, showing resilience in tough times. Her ability to keep going after such a devastating loss shows her strength of character. Her journey in the entertainment world is marked by both successes and challenges. From humble beginnings to fame, she has faced highs and lows. Despite the personal tragedies, she emerged as a respected actress known for her talent and dedication. Her ability to overcome tough times is inspiring to many aspiring actors and actresses. In conclusion, while her career is celebrated for achievements on screen, it's important to recognize the personal struggles she faced. Her resilience and strength of character shine through in her ability to keep chasing her dreams.